Welcome back guys, CryptoFollow channel. Today I would like to talk about altcoin season. When fix profit from alts. Let's dive in. Maybe for someone, it will be the first cycle. Maybe it will be the first bull run. And maybe it will be the first altcoin season. Yes, uh, this will be the pretty good time for your portfolio but the main goal is always accumulate in zone of accumulation distribute in zone of distribution not be so greedy not uh, fall in fomo not to uh, doubt if you fix profit uh, too early and not stock trying to not stock in uh, some altcoins just in virtual assets for the next bear market i would like to show you the few moments where you have to know and understand about that market a lot of people think so the altcoin season it's some some magic right so when you hop into altcoin and write like one year two year three year you open every single day your portfolio and check only the pnl like a, another 20 percent another 50 percent another 100 percent and you think it will go to infinity you know um, and uh, influencer around star shiller the stupid videos about next 100x uh, coin this token will pump uh, 10x more 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 but the reality is absolutely different because uh, a lot of people just talk in that tokens because they're so greedy they don't have a plan where to out first of all i would like to show you this one so it's just a basic metric uh, what you can track it on the blockchain center this is a altcoin season and a bitcoin season so this is a bitcoin season this is altcoin season now it's 61 uh, percent take a look now we are at 61 altcoin season where we over than 75 we are now around uh, the stage of uh, february 2021 then we saw the pullback right and from uh, let's say march 2021 till may at the top and some altcoins still uh summer so only one pump it like you can see it took us um, i guess five months five months is more than enough to pump all altcoins to the top after that we can drop and bounce again but after that we anyway go into bear market and not all altcoins pump it at the same time so you have to understand it's money rotating some outs some from some tech sector pump first uh, some less BDC dominance uh, zones I posted today in channel just example of course it's not 100% should copy paste the previous cycle but from the top of BDC dominance in December some waiting to the bottom this one in May some 21 all main altcoin season uh, just took 140 days so imagine it's not so much time it's just a little bit more than uh, four months and then from the top of BTC dominance to the bottom of a bear market to the bottom so it was a drop in September 616 days and that time in November 22 it was a flash crash on FTX and it took like from the top on BTC dominance to the bottom of the bear market around 700 days 693 days it means during all this time period 616 days we will see the top for alts and the bottom for alts <laughs> yes it sounds weird but uh, this is a fact that's why take a look if just in theory if uh, in uh, november somewhere before it was a top for bdc dominance at this current moment we can't know either the top or not maybe we'll go higher at this current moment we can't know we work only with the data so take a look uh, if uh, we took from the november it's only for 16 616 days the bottom potential bottom of the next bear market all uh, crypto can be in summer 26 if it took like 693 days it can be like october 26 the bottom just potential bottom of the all uh, market and if we take a look like 140 uh, days it's gonna be the april 25 at the end of uh, uh, main altcoin season so that's the logic guys uh, the alts will pump so fast it will be total free on the market everybody will talk about it just the beginning we just on the first stage we just in the hope zone uh, we just uh, in a um, bull we, we just in a bird trap and all of that stuff but yes your main goal is just hop in in right time and out in right time
And uh, I don't think so. The BTC dominance will drop this time under 39%. It will be, of course, the madness for alts. It will be perfect, perfect scenario if we drop under the previous low, like uh, 39%. But in this stage, in this block between 44%, till I guess uh, 40%, it will be the okay zone to fix profit. You can fix 100%, you can fix during all this uh, downfall of BTC dominance step by step, but you have to build a plan for each token. You never sell exact at the top, it's just a myth. Nobody, nobody sell at the top. Maybe accidentally you can uh, catch exact top, but it's just a luck. Build a plan where to fix each altcoin in your portfolio. Uh, logically, I think we can go a little bit higher than small pullback December, January, February, maybe, you know, by seasonality. And then we need to uh, create some sentiment around. We need to create some uh, mood on the market with good news in the macro around. So everything okay in the world. Absolutely everything okay. We're just at the beginning. It's just the beginning of the mass adoption. Uh, the... The companies start to um, show the reports, so they hold uh, some crypto. A lot of funds should invest in some uh, projects. Total area. And it's going to be the crazy altcoin season where you need to fix profit. I would like to show you an example of uh, how it looks like on uh, old uh, tokens which pumped uh, last time. Yes, you'll be surprised, but I would like to show you the other and algorithm. So take a look. So this is uh, December, some winning. This was a top on uh, BTC dominance. We pump it till February 21 and April 21. So this is uh, this time. So around April, May 21. It was a top for some alts. Yes, uh, Algo uh, pump it like, um, take a look, around even Algo. I mean, even Algo uh, pump it like uh, 500%. So if Algo will pump uh, now from this current stages 500%, take a look. It can be like pretty good one gates, right? Uh, around two dollar. This is it, guys. After that, we showed uh, we saw that pullback down by seasonality summer. That one. So we bounce summer all this summer. The alts dying. BTC almost uh, also going to correction, then pull back down, and in September, uh, uh, September October we saw another top for alts because the BTC dominance at the bottom. What the algo shows from the August, it's pumped again, new one like two hundred percent. So if the history repeat, and in general uh, algo last time pumped like eight hundred percent, almost nine. So imagine if the history repeat, so we can see that some pullback like this one till, uh, let's say, a spring song with one, then drop, not hit the new all-time high, then drop it down. And if we will see another lag up, yes, it can be new all-time high, for example, for uh, Algo from, let's say, like this one, 200%, $3.60. Five, uh, everybody start talking about a $5 and all of that stuff, but we can just uh, sweep up that top and go in again down. If not, of course, we can uh, drop like this one, bounce, cat bounce, and going down to into the new bear market till uh, uh, October 26. So during all this block, we can see the parabolic move. We can see the a 3 and new low. Not historical low, low, but new low. Uh, let's take a look, example on uh, Cardano. Yes, Cardano last time also pumped. Take a look, uh, the December is only. Now a lot of people uh, complain, oh, take a look, the old uh, Dina talking pumps. Guys, it's not about the Dina talking or not. It's about uh, the uh, money rotating, money inflow, money outflow from the tokens. Take a look, from December is only, uh, the Cardano pumped 1,800% gains. Till... May 21, exactly till this time, from December 20 till May 21. It's not took so much time, guys, right? After that, we drop it down into a correction in the summer. And from summer, once again, small pullback up to new high, 200. Many tokens not hit this new high. 
a lot of tokens just uh, form like this one, drop, and something like this one. So just in case, guys, not all the time, the altcoins in, um, for example, autumn will form the new all them high again. So no, it can be the cat, um, cat bounce. So this is it. And uh, here, if we took, of course, I don't think so, the Cardano pump like uh, 1,800 again. But if, for example, uh, this was a, a top in November uh, for uh, BTC dominance, I think uh, we can see like pump to sweep that high, you know, or even new all them high. And after that, uh, going higher again in May 21, spring 21, April, it's going to be March. We can't know the timing, right? Then drop it down again in summer and bounce in autumn. And it's going to be the end of uh, altcoin season. For BTC dominance, like you remember, uh, we dump it. I would like to show you. Take profit indicator. Uh, here, monthly time frame. We tested the buy line. Unfortunately, unfortunately, guys, yes, we tested. And the next steps is this one low, like 0 0.02940, and this one low. I hope, and I don't think so, we will drop uh, that low. So maximum what I can uh, see for uh, that uh, Ethereum BTC trading pair, it's uh, 0 0.029, this one. 50% uh, of that range. For the mail volume at this current moment at 0 0.025. This one and uh, this capitulation. 29% uh, was from that low from this current prices. It means uh, the altcoins can go into correction like 38%. So yes, a lot of uh, alts already pumped uh, over than 100% over than 200%. So that's why guys, it's more than real to see some pullback. But the main goal of what I shared uh, previously uh, the end of alt season will be where we test the take profit line or exit line. When? Nobody knows. So I would like to see something like this one in uh, spring 25. C close yearly open, test the take profit line and the exit line. And then going down, bounce and drop it down to the new bear market. So that's the point, guys. I highly recommend you uh, track the previous videos about the uh, Ethereum BTC to understand the logic, why exactly we stop it at uh, the buy line, you know, how it works, how to work with my customer, like said. So, guys, uh, build a plan. Build a plan for each token uh, for the next altcoin season, for the uh, upcoming altcoin season. And yes, uh, and you can fix the profit, for example, an algo. Uh, you can fix some profit. You get a hundred percent. You get you, you build a plan. You fix he, here like twenty percent or withdraw initial deposit. Then fix uh, fifty percent and leave like uh, I don't know forty percent more for the crazy new all-time high. If you believe in that project, if we see something like this one, you fix it here. Leave thirty percent and you see by seasonality we're going down. You fix uh, last uh, thirty percent here. So that's a plan for each token. A lot of people uh, wait uh, something like uh, this move. I don't think so. We'll see something like this one. I don't think so. This is a super cycle or so. Uh, by macro, by geopolitical in the world, it not looks like uh, so brightful uh, future for the altcoins uh, for the next, uh, I don't know, one or two years. But we will see. We will see. So guys, I hope you like this video. Wrap this in a comment. What do you think about an upcoming altcoin season? If you would like to trade with my customer, Chris, I will show you in this video. Just write me DM. Subscribe, chain, hit the like button, hit the notification button. Don't forget to join my Telegram channel. See you next time, guys.